Hey guys, Galaxy Reaper here, and in this video, I'm going to be showing my little FNAF co plush collection that I have, and I might be rating some of them as well. I hope you enjoy the video, and be sure to like and subscribe. And yeah, I'll get right into the video. So the first one is going to be... This Jumbo Foxy plush that I won at a carnival thing. He is not an officially branded one, but he's huge. I don't know. I'm gonna have to rate him a 7 out of 10 just because he's not an official one. And yeah, I don't know. So the next one I have is Nightmare Foxy. And I don't know, his design's okay, but couldn't be proved, so I'll do 5 out of 10. And then we have this Jumbo Movie Cupcake that I got. And I love it so much. I was super excited when it came out. And I don't know, I like it. It looks cool, part of my collection. I'm going to rate it a 9 out of 10. I don't know, it's just cool. And then I have Nightmare Freddy. I don't know, he, he's not my most favorite out of my collection. But it could be worse. Uh, I'll do 4 out of 10 for him. And then I have this cupcake dude from the games. I don't know. I think he's pretty cute. I'm gonna have to rate him 9 out of 10. Because cupcake. And then I have the Circus Baby plush. I don't know. I feel like it could be designed be a little better, in my opinion. So I'm going to rate it 5 out of 10. Then I have this Mangle plush. It's okay. But, I don't know. I've seen better ones. 7 out of 10. And then I have this cute little toy foxy plush. I love it so much. So adorable. One of my favorite ones. So I'll rate it 10 out of 10. Because it's adorable. It's sticking its tongue out. Then we have this bonnet plush. She don't like to stand up very well, but it's pretty decent for the design, I would say. It's okay. 9 out of 10. And then we have my Lulbit plush. I think it's pretty cute, but there's room for improvement. So I'm going to rate it 9 out of 10. Then I have this Foxy plush, kind of standard, I guess, for plush for him, but I'm going to rate it 8 out of 10. And then we have this Bonnie plush. He has some stains on him, which I have no idea where that came from. Which is kind of disappointing, so I'm going to rate him 7 out of 10 just because of that. Then I got this Fanverse Candy plush. Seems pretty cool, but I don't know, his eyes are kind of funny. I'm going to have to rate him 7 out of 10. Just the eyes, man. 
And then there's this black light foxy plush that won't stand up. But I like him. He's pretty cool, but he's pretty much just a colored foxy. So I'm going to rate him 8 out of 10. And then we have the puppet plush. I like this one a lot. I think it's pretty cool. Pretty cute. I'm going to have to rate it 10 out of 10. Then I have this Golden Freddy plush, which is very sought after and very cool. Very collectible. I like it a lot. I'm going to rate it 10 out of 10. Another one of my favorites is this Exotic Butters plush, which is ridiculous, but it's hilarious. Funny. And I'm going to have to rate it 10 out of 10 because Exotic Butters. Then I have this Phantom Foxy plush. His eye patch was how he was made. It was sewn kind of funny. I don't know. I don't really like that. It's not even. And it annoys me. So he's a 6 out of 10. And then we have this Spring Trap plush. He seems okay. I don't know. His smile is kind of goofy. But I do like Springtrap. He's my favorite animatronic. So I'm going to have to rate him a 7 out of 10. I, I don't know. And then we have my most hated plush. Self-explanatory. Toy Bonnie. Why did they design him like that? I'm going to rate him a 1 out of 10. Toy Chica, on the other hand, they designed her very well done. I liked how they designed her. So I'm going to have to rate her a 8 out of 10. Then we have the Blacklight Cupcake. He, I don't know, he's kind of has weird colors going on. I don't know if I'm a fan of those colors, but he's cupcake, so 8 out of 10. And last but not least, we have this U2's Springtrap plush. He's probably one of my favorite ones. I recently just got him, and I just love him so much. I don't know why. I think he's really cool. So I'm going to rate him a 1,000 out of 10 because, yeah, he's my new favorite. 